Brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality parts and the best service on the internet. Hey everybody, I'm Brian. I want to give you guys uh, some details as far as how to identify coil spring to torsion bar suspension. Now, let's say for an example you have a Ford Ranger and some of these front end suspension components require you to identify what suspension you have. So let's go ahead and take a look on the inside here. We have the ease of a lift and we actually cranked out the wheel for you. You can actually do this in the ease of your driveway without a lift. Just kind of turn the wheel out and take a look inside the wheel well area here. If you happen to see this coil design here, that is a coil spring design. This is actually started off as a straight steel rod. It's heated up and wrapped in this design here, hence the coil design. Uh, it is designed to have a certain spring rate, which means that's going to give you the right height of the vehicle and help with dampening some road bumps. You can see that it fits up inside of a pocket right here, and then it goes down and attaches down to your lower control arm. So as that control arm flexes, it's going to help with, that, uh, with the right height and the, and the bumps in the road. If you don't see this coil design here, chances are you're going to have another design called the torsion bar that's located underneath the vehicle and attaches to the lower control arm into the chassis of the vehicle. So if you look underneath here, you actually see a bar that goes into the, uh, into the control arm and this is actually the torsion bar. So this vehicle doesn't have coil springs and you just follow the straight back continuously through and it anchors right to this cross member right here. Thanks for tuning in. We hope this video helped you out. Next time you need parts for your car, please visit 1AAuto.com. Also check out our other helpful how-to as well as diagnosis videos.